Good afternoon. Today is Friday, March 3rd, 2017. I'm Brianna Boutet. NASA almost had a spacecraft run into the Martian moon Phobos. We've got details. And I'm going to Murphy. Woolly mammoths may have died out due to genetic meltdown. Your CSN News starts now. Congratulations to the winners of the 12th Annual Talent Show hosted by Project Graduation. First place, Eleanor Strait for Piano Solo, Fantasy Impromptu. Second place, Ang Angelica Dockery for vocal, vocal Solo, When We Were Young by Adele. Third place, Tana Dowling and Kylie Lippert, Vocal Duet and Ukulele Mashup of Three Songs and Visual Arts. Maria Strait, first place for Painting. Panda Express is hosting a fundraiser for the Foreign Language Society today at 12th Avenue Restaurant in Nampa. Pick up a flyer in room 127 or in the front office and take it with you. The flyer must accompany your meal order so the club can receive a percentage of the purchase. Attention, Foreign Language Society members. There will be a meeting on March 7th after school in room 127. This is a mandatory meeting. Be on time. Today is the last day to join track and field. After that point, we'll see you next year. Also, next Friday, March 10th, is the Sadie Hawkins desk. So ladies, go get them. We'll be right back after this. First impression, make it a good one and visit Dr. Keller today. Today we'll have a high of 54 with a low of 39 and some sun, and tomorrow it will be raining with a high of 56 and a low of 36. Back to you, Gwenna. Thank you. The last woolly mammoths to walk the earth were so racked with genetic disease they lost their sense of smell, shunned, shunned company, and had a strange shiny coat. That's the verdict of scientists who have analyzed ancient DNA of the extinct animals from mutations. The studies suggest that the last mammoths died out after their DNA became riddled with errors. The knowledge could inform conservation effort living animals. There are fewer than 100 Asiatic cheetahs left in the world, while the remaining mountain gorilla population is estimated at about 300. The numbers are similar to those of the last woolly mammoths living on the Wrangell Island in the Arctic Ocean around 4,000 years ago, where the mammoth DNA came from. The MAVEN spacecraft has been orbiting Mars for more than two years, monitoring the red planet's atmosphere. On February 28th, it performed a rocket motor burn to speed up just a little bit and change trajectories to avoid crossing paths with Phobos, NASA officials said in a statement. The total speed up was just 0.4 meters per second, which is less than one mile per hour. Researchers noticed that Phobos and MAVEN had a chance of colliding March 6th. That gave them a week of advance notice in order to pull off the small maneuver to avoid a crash. Now the two will miss each other by about 2.5 minutes before their orbits were crossing the same point within just seven seconds of each other. The SAT word of the day is lucid, which means easily understood, clear, transparent, shining, bright. You could use it this way. The young writer was praised for her lucid prose. She told her stories in such a clear and easy to comprehend style. Thanks for watching, and remember, if the news breaks, we'll, we'll fix, fix it. it. 